Two new physics studies show different ways to control how atoms work together, a key step for future quantum technologies. In the first study, scientists explored super radiance, where many atoms emit light in perfect sync, creating a bright collective burst. By tuning how atoms interact, both directly and through shared light, researchers can make that emission stronger or weaker. This could lead to quantum batteries that charge instantly, super-efficient lasers, and ultra-precise sensors or atomic clocks. The second study focused on dissipation engineering, using energy loss not as a problem, but as a tool. Researchers used lasers to control how atoms lose energy, so that instead of random decay, they automatically fall into stable, entangled states. This technique can keep quantum computers stable, build quantum communication links, and create self-correcting sensors. Both methods revolve around the same idea, learning to program the invisible forces between atoms. One controls how they shine together, the other controls how they settle together. Together, they could make future quantum devices faster, brighter, and far more reliable than anything we have today. Imagine if every kind of energy, sound, light, magnetic, nuclear, and even gravity, could merge and interact as one. That would mean creating a unified energy field where all forces of nature speak the same language. In such a world, we could convert any energy into any other with no loss sound into light, magnetism into power, or nuclear energy into gravity waves. Communication could happen through any material or across space without fading. Power would be limitless, drawn from sunlight, motion, or even the fabric of space itself. Mastering all wave types would also mean controlling matter directly, rearranging atoms, repairing materials instantly, and maybe even bending gravity for propulsion. Right now, each wave type follows its own rules. Mechanical, electromagnetic, nuclear, or gravitational. So combining them remains beyond current science. But if we ever unlock that unity, it would mark the moment humanity truly masters the energy of the universe.